that's how I started doing any multi sport was all day. Midnight by the time you went down there. It's 11. I'm watching the most interesting drama on uh, Netflix. Yeah. It's about um, the Romanovs. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's fascinating. Yeah. I didn't realize that, you know, if, if he didn't screw it up and and then Rasputin, did, uh, you know, did you know much about him? I don't know much. Do you know his name? Which? Rasputin. Anything about it, no, other than his name? No, I know a little about it. Like what? What do you know? I, so I don't know. Right? I, 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 I named her raccoon. I checked. Uh, I read him again to make sure. He was a, a, a monk. Ask you know, that you know, uh, sort of subscribe to this um, very controversial theory that uh, hedonism sex. Oh, I do remember this. Yes. You know, a, a yeah. monk that, yeah. and he was just a, just a womanizer. He would just, you know, Wasn't make like women. A, he was almost like the family in-house monk. Oh, what? The in-house monk. Like the yes, yes, the because their son had hemophilia, right. and and he was the only one who could get the son from he not bleeding like or, he or a, a healer. So yeah. then he became um, sort of the main advisor. He's a part of the court. Yeah, and, and, and basically he overruled all the you know, legitimate advisors. And, and at the same time, Russia was dealing with a revolution and a war, multiple wars. And Nicholas was married to the Tsarina, whatever her name was, and she was from Germany and um, a German princess, and they were at war with Germany. And Rasputin was having an affair with the Tsarina while they told Nicholas to go to the war front and they ran the country. And it's just really fascinating. That you know, you can see like one man yeah. can impact history, and uh, that's my concern with, exactly with exactly. Trump. 
Stalin. Yeah, yeah, these people can truly impact history in very negative ways. Yes. Or if it's much more difficult to you know have it's a like positive. It's more double death like a Churchill. Yes. Um, but if things had gone differently, you know there would still be czars in Russia, and arguably there there are. I mean that's what Putin is. Yeah. Yeah. I mean the, he he is a czar. He is he is a monarch. I mean there's no. Um, no pretending anything else. And he just doesn't seem to age. I mean, yeah. you know, throughout, you know, our lifetime, he seems to have been... I do. Yeah, there was a Yeltsin yeah. took over, and then, and then because Putin was um, head of the KGB at the time, Argue, you know, he had information on Yeltsin, and then he got into that name, and it, it just seemed like a smooth transition. And then he just took over power. I mean, that's what happens. Yeah, it's like the third Susie. Yeah. 